This is the second album I'm releasing this year, but the difference between this one and the one that I dropped in March, Father Creep, is that this is a compilation of music that I've been doing for the last five years, just stuff that's never been released in South Africa that I think, you know, really should be. So I hand-selected a bunch of music from my catalogue that I found to be um, the biggest songs. I went for big songs to break the South African market open. I'd worked on from a number of different directions previously and my last album was very experimental for me personally. That was me um, kind of giving in to my every whim in studio. And this one, um, it's to introduce listeners to my music so that it's not that obscure music in the corner anymore. I'm not really interested in that. And what I found previously was that a lot of music didn't fit format, format people here for radio and television are pretty obsessed with the format. My interest is always trying to bridge sounds and sectors that I find to be compatible. South Africa still really compartmentalizes stuff, not necessarily in terms of genre, or, oh my god I'm being defined by blah blah blah, but just the basic thing of like um, race. Race is still a big deal and that hasn't really crossed music music boundaries you know there has to be a white house club and a black house club a white rock night and a black rock night i'm just about um represent trying as much to represent myself as possible so that I don't need to be misrepresented by other people but i mean the idea of being the king of guaito or something is it's an exciting prospect it's just not accurate i really don't know what people expect of a black musician in South Africa but for me it's 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 about what I want to do and I want to um, represent my generation of black artists very strongly you know I want to um, redefine what is to be expected but at the same time I've got a really proud lineage of black South African artists that I want to continue and want to strengthen um, hopefully this project with Tani Somazo is gonna be you know Phenomenal. I'm excited about that. Um, a big crazy surprise was um, working on a collaboration with Damon Alban as far as producing and we have to get into studio and finish that. So that's going to be around January. I'm um, going to be touring with the group Gorillas in late December. So it's just keep on trucking. As far as what people's um, demands are or expectations are, I'm not sure and I don't care so much, but I do care to make strong songs, to make um, accessible songs, catchy songs, big songs, meaningful songs, powerful songs at any given point. <laughs> 